Welcome back guys to Grandia, where last episode with rain pouring down upon Dight, our party started to head to the Typhoon Tower to resolve the threat. But first we had to scale Mount Typhoon itself, an area filled with poisonous perils made inhospitable by a prior red rainstorm. Having started leveling up new spells with another mana egg obtained and spent, we get closer to entering the tower itself. Okay, we found more enemy huts. Sneak attack! Just get in there and hold, you dig it! Ah well, this is the weapon experience turn then, obviously. Justin has all the strength that we could ever need. Looks like one more set of attacks from him. Hello! It's an ambush. All right, get him, Fina. Get him, Justin. Got him. Sword level up too. You're no match for me. Worst ambush of all time. Right, he's now, Justin is now up to 69 wits. Still not anywhere near catching up with Fina, sure. He's doing his best to go. Oh. I found probably money by the fact that we heard a ting. Oh. A demon amulet. Plus five defense, plus one all magic resistance. Seems kind of cool. You know what? I'll actually remove your plus attack for that. Extra defense and magic resistance probably a bit more powerful over the entirety of that effect. That's how I look at it. Where am I? Where am I? <laughs> like, no enemies out here. Hello? Anyone inside? What? I literally, that was back. I didn't even realize. When did I end up back on the ground floor? That's a good question. Well, there's some enemies, which means we haven't been here. I have no clue! <laughs> May as well get some more spell experience. Like, how does that not hit the lower two? Someone explain. Spell animation was all over them. Another vaccine obtained. Justin's about to level again. Okay, so we were here, then we started walking this way, and then somehow I ended up going down. No. Oh, these guys are angry. The birds, they are attack me. So I somehow managed to go right round in the circle, didn't I? Yeah, that's actually what happened. It's only a little confusing. Please 
but I managed to go right round in a circle in a really limited space. Earth level up. Pino's learned Tremor. Remembering that she actually has a lot of level 2 mana to be using that with, that's not too bad. You're hitting the other guy. Pretty easy, right? How did he not? Well, I'm really confused. Like, to hit who there? Did Gavwin fail to knock someone out? What? There's another set of enemies coming from that tent. May as well use another dig it. I'm pretty sure those two can take this thing out after all. Please protect us. What a cinch. So how much spell level does digging still get at this point in time? 20, so you have to do five casts for level now. Stop coming out of here now. Good to know. Hello. I am invade your tents. I can't see anything when I do so. Help weed again. Wow, this is intense. Going the right way, but why have all these lizards? I'm guessing they're completely immune to poison, of course. Why have they all made their home here? I guess it's the most hospitable surrounding for them. Please protect us. Nice of her to get her spell in just as that arrow is essentially about to pierce the eye of that poor lizard. Oh, not again! <laughs> it never ends! Uh, I'm sure you can just cast digging. May as well go for that plus one strength. Please protect us! Maybe we'll level up digging itself at this point. Slash mace is its action. They're both trying to use slash mace. You're no match for me. Right, Justin levels up from all the battling we've been doing. Only 13 wit behind Vina now. But way more strength. Oh, there's an enemy here! Oh, what? Why is it in the tent? What? How's it even in there? Oh, right, Justin, just go for a combo. Kill the nearest one to you. I think that's the one that's going first, after all. We need to take out the plague spore guy as well, don't we? No, you got plague spores off. Oh god, Sue has a skull on her now. Sue has the plague. We just exercise the demon. That's not so much the plague as something else. You 
We're gonna have to come with this guy when we get the plague. Oh my goodness! It's literally, I mean, the plague would literally be a death mark. But still, a bit literal. Okay, well we made it out and we're still alive, so that's always a good sign. How many level 1 MP do I have? 5. So you're pretty much out once we've done this. There should be a restore point nearby. Let's get level 1 up! I didn't actually realise you were that near to a heal level. So now you're level 4 on that and level 3, so you've gained even more MP, really. Level 5, yeah. It seems like she'll get all heal if she goes one more level up. If it is that. And two levels of fire will get me a spell as well. Okay, well I'm obviously going to have been turned around now. I lost track of which tents I've been in to search for goodies. Oh, there's some cash in here. Wow, how big is this area? <laughs> it's the area I keep up at. I got the red chest. So this is the edge of the area. Oh my goodness. It just goes on. The never ending play he glands. Oh. Last one MP. Please protect us. Quite relaxing to know that we always have Gadgin Gadwin if we want to go the nuclear option with ridiculous powerful attacks. You're no match for me. And we still have a ton of level two spells waiting for Phoenix to be used. Not got her closer. Ah what the hell? The birds are coming again! Are there treasures in there in the tent? Not enough. Gatwin, get him. Pretty easy, right, Cuff? You stole the KO. Hopefully, I've got a lot of cash here by now. Fina and that are getting near leveling up again. Nothing in this ten. avoid the fight there, can I? They saw me and I want to use the viewpoint. Alright, you do have Tremor now, right? I'm imagining I can't hit that one on the edge anyway. In fact, they've all started moving. Oh, Earth, protect us all! Their positions have changed. Oh, I still hear free. Tremor just does poorly on those guys, doesn't it? That's what we've learned. Get in there before he uses Blade Spawn! That one still lives! Level 4 Earth. There's another blooming thing in there. Right, that's. We're really near the area. Oh, 
We're not far away now. No clue what we just picked up. Ooh, ooh, uh, ooh, what's that? Somehow think that Justin's not gonna get any attacks in here. You're no match for me. Gavin just blasted that guy into a wall. I feel like I'm playing a lot of games that are based on area exploration and battling lately. It's almost like it's one of the hallmarks of JRPGs. <laughs> nah, it can't be. Can't be right, can it? I can feel it's going last nowadays. <laughs> Pretty easy. Oh, Justin got another sword level, so that's never too wit. The other two are very close to leveling up now. It seems like we're here. We've maybe explored everywhere now. Hooray! So our goal is there, but really what we want to do is we want to go around the entire place. Look at this. Which is a mage seat. What plus one max MP for levels one, two, three. So all of the levels is what you're saying. All of the levels. You've already got loads. Randomly, I'll give it to Justin. That looked like it also refilled all the MP. Oh, there's a truffle in here. A truffle confuses one enemy. Obviously, I haven't been in that tent yet. Are all the enemies in this area now defeated? Like we've beaten up quite a few of them, so let's head in uh, here and hope that we don't need spells. We finally reached it. Typhoon Tower. It was a massive area to explore outside. I think everyone was full HP anyway, so we couldn't get any extra spell levels. Ah! Took a while. Does it sound like it says boop? There's just random boop in the song. Yeah, there's a random boop in the song. Well, let's begin exploring and wonder what's in here. That's an enemy, right? <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, it had like a, this is wrong. Don't step on this. The monsters are coming. The monsters are coming. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let me tremor you. The monsters are coming! That's a lot of enemies that dropped. Oh, Earth, protect us all! all right, let's get you to level 5 Earth. You only hit 3? Oh, that spell's got way more range than you expect. Building that wit. Pretty easy, Just right? all of a sudden, the blast of death that comes through onto all of them. Right, these guys give gold. And experience. Level up for Fina. Now, I was about to say, there's just going to be endless packs of them now that I've stood on that. This is elite cleps. Better than your average clep. The question is, do they stand up to Gadwin? Oh wind, blow him away. 
Not really. Bina's gonna steal that KO on the one in the back. Oh no! You changed target! Clap, elite clap. Oh, I just see. I guess I have to take all their items and take everything's place because I'm a bit of a kleptomaniac. Two bad puns so far, just in this little small period of time. Is this how babies are made? All right, what do I use? I haven't actually seen this. Fire away! Fire away! Here it goes! Most of those arrows completely missed. But it did quite good damage and gave us some good levels. Now, do you think if I step on that switch, it will cause more enemies to spawn, or do you think that's it? Oh, they lived? you got to be joking me. Wait, I think they're dead after this. So I will... Endure. Dabwin turned away like, didn't even let me do anything. How could you? So Justin's about to level up on wind skill. Nina picked up 16 air. Okay. Seems if I press the switch again, no enemies appear, which is good. Shall I go left then? See what's this way? Is this a dead end? Why are there loads of people on a box? That's actually worrying. Why are there loads of people on the box? Is this room going to flood with poison or something? You kind of missed most of your actual targets there, I've got to say. <laughs> Fire away again! Got to get you straight to somehow. If we're next to a recovery point, the grinding becomes pretty easy after all. Just use everything. So that's only 18 weapon skill either. Sue's leveled up. Why are they all on a box? Why are they all on a box? They're running at me now. Why were you on a box? That yeah, one, go get this guy. Nina, cast more tremors on these guys. The sword leveled up. Does he really need it? Fina has become the pure spellcaster now. <laughs> Sue and Justin back to back taking care of all the enemies. Can I push this up? Well, I like this room again. Manor egg! Guess I can't really pop back to town quickly. Oh! They're guarding a green switch! Guys, I need this! Can you attack me? Hello! No, okay. I think I need the green switch for the obvious reason that it's it's a green switch. Oh, every time I... <gasps> so that was what was happening when I hit the barrels. I was angering different factions until one of them landed on the green switch. Yeah, that makes sense. I 
Sure, I guess. It works. And when you say critical spinning attack on one enemy, I do wonder if it's because it's close to the other guy, if you're gonna just wreck him. It does not, but it really does wreck him. It does some solid damage. Oh wow, zero damage. Hold a second, at least. Not bad, eh? I guess there's no note around that says, "Move the barrels." That's the way you will find your way further forward. Where the hell does this take me? I don't know, but that's definitely the way to go. So let's go the other way because, you know, treasures, right? We've got mana egg in here. We need more. It's so weird that there's random boop noises in this game. Well, that's a big group. Boop. Wait, we've got an elite lizard rider now as well? That was getting a bit fancy now. Getting a bit too fancy for me. Damage. I guess I'll just keep them in almost an endless stun lock when you think about it, so other people will be able to take turns. I keep saying Lizalfos. They're not Lizalfos. This isn't Hilda. It's not that Justin's voice actor has the is the voice of Young Link or anything. No, no. In Japanese, nah, that's definitely not a thing. Right, Gadwin. Time to march. This will teach you. Got to build IRF experience somehow, right? Vina has learned. Wow! <laughs> My guy's throwing stuff at me. Come here, Justin's after you. So that was for the five fire five. Not bad, eh? Yeah, five 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 Earth. Wow. Yeah, we just need a certain actor's sound effect whenever that happens, yeah? Is that how this works now? I'm actually starting to wonder if this way is uh, the actual goal. This area, this floor is massive. Again. Uh, whoop, okay, I slid down to the bottom. <laughs> well, I didn't mean to go down here, but now I am. So I guess we live here now. So yeah, whales learnt, that's a level one. What else can I actually get her at this point? If I were to get her water to 12, she'd have a spell, but that's ages off. Water to five gets her a spell, eight gets her to spell. So basically, if I just get her water to 12, she will learn many new spells. <laughs> many, many new spells, in fact. Leveling water for her seems to be the most important thing right now. Gabwin can't learn anything more than what he's got there. Seems to be the way to play. Oh yeah, I forgot about leveling Seuss Fire. So she might get some wit, so she might actually be able to do moves. Oops. Seuss 
Sue would one day like to cast spells. Puffy Kicks reached max level, by the way. I mean, fire spells are the only way that Sue can actually gain wit. So I need to use them. Wow. <laughs> I think, like, things are about to die. I'll go in on this guy. Here goes! Oh no! Didn't hit the guy on the outside edge! And in fact, two of them are still alive. Get him! Get the other guy! You're no match for me. Make sure you don't accidentally step on Sue while you're trying to sword fight or anything, just crush her. That would be nice. Okay, three riders, no, one rider, two elites. Let's get ourselves into the back row. Just gonna be casting burn with her endlessly now and Justin will keep just attacking. All right, there's no attacking water spells I can use except for Crackle. The shared experience type move. This'll teach you. Oh, fire actually hit both. Nice. Or did Justin manage to land the hit? Ah, Fina, save us! Oh, he managed to use slash mace. Oh, it's fine. If we get hit, then Fina can just use heal. In terms of water skill that she actually acquires from using that, eight isn't a massive amount. Slightly. Ever so slightly more. Boop. And I think a normal heal actually gives at this point. <laughs> You get that guy. He's the biggest. The baddest. Man, another tremor over there. A burn on there would probably actually hit two. Is Justin gonna come in here to really help out? I mean, he could use Tremor too, I guess. One's dead after all, so that would actually give him a reason to get some more Earth experience. And would freeze everyone the there for theory. a while. It's the spell cast around. Think she'll get there just in time? How maybe? A wind blow him away! Sue just got wonked on the head. A wind level up. Justin, beat him to it! Oh he's defending! Actually survived all that. Oh, never mind. Come, totally. Try again. All right, twenty-one win experience got there. Earth skill went up plus thirty-two. Uh, 
Hang on, this is where I would like, you know, uh, it would be nice to have a button that instantly goes into a heal mode or something, just in case. So if you know what I mean, you can just spam it and get it done. Okay, so I need to go that way. Any more treasures? He says as he hits all the bonging barrels. Boop. There's another slidey bit over there. That's the slidey bit I came down. Oh, actually, there's no way out here? Ah. It's actually a trapped area. The only way out is steps that way, or...? Okay, yeah, well, it seems like pressing that switch isn't going to summon more enemies on me, because I already summoned the enemies on me. Oh, wait a second. No, I summoned the enemies at the top of the stairs. Oh, well. Can't win them all. Wah, wah, wah. Feel the Earth's fury! I don't actually know how much it will heal heals. Yet. Alright, Earth level for Justin. Yet more strength. I do wonder if the bird will work. Oh, the bird goes first. Okay, I was thinking that Fina would get them all. Okay, I don't want that guy to die. Okay, he didn't. Is that a combo? I feel like Tremor's the way to build up our skill now. Now with so many still alive. Fine, dab it again. Some extra whip. All right, we won. And another vaccine obtained. Ah! Ah! I can't take it. I'll get rid of the antidote and take this because, of course, we have at least two people now that can use cure. Uh, hello. Can I take this? It looks like a big old shield and these look like swords. I mean, there's like shields and swords everywhere here. I mean, my shield's made out of like shells and stuff, most of my guys. Mind if I could have something a bit better. Power Whip's nearly maxed out, by the way. Some of my skills are just maxing out anyway. Feels about too much of my own input. Here goes! Oh, Earth, protect us all! I think I only used Puffy Kit like three or four times at the start of the game. I didn't see much else go up apart from that. Okay, so we're in here. I guess I should pull this rope and go... There's enemies attacking me! Because that's probably what's better happen. If I had to guess. No, nope, that's the way to Typhoon Tower Level 2. However, the pointer points this way. go down this way. Oh, it's a guy with a big old treasure chest over there. Where's... I angered them. Did I get them or not? Who got who? I guess that answers that then, doesn't it? Oh, 
Come on, hit me, Fina. A bit mean of you. I don't think we're going to land a very good tremor here. This will teach you. Cadwin's <laughs> really mid swing. So that's so level six. Never vaccine. I mean, again, I might look for an antidote because I'm pretty sure I've got other antidotes. Discard that and then take another vaccine. Sounds good. Oh my goodness, these rooms are massive. I'll just keep angering these guys forever. It's a lot easier to level up things that aren't water, isn't it? I think I just need a straight up water attack. It would be great. Where are you going, Catwin? Got both. It's good. More experience. Sue has learned Puffy Fire. She finally reached level two fire. You're no match for me. She only just reached level two fire. This brings us back up there. That rolls us back down to that other location we've seen. I mean, I guess I didn't explore all of this location. What the hell is this step stairs? But wait, what? Step stairs actually takes me. Oh my goodness, we're gonna be here for a living years. Don't have respawned the enemies. Thank you very much. What? I missed this treasure chest. Has items I can't even get. Oh, a confused charm. Well, I definitely need to have that. Is that plus three permanent attack for a friend? Being able to not be confused is pretty good. Uh, I'm assuming that if a confused charm is in here, that the potential to get confused is very high. Which is worrying. Oh, what does the blue switch do? Oh my goodness. We are truly adventurers now. Oh, Earth, protect us all. Well, at the beginning of the game was kind of solid story, NPC dialogue, etc. And now we've we've passed on from that. And are now just adventurers out in the wilds. Doing what adventurers do, right? What a cinch. Big dungeoneering. Okay, so we can slide down there. 
And there is what? It doesn't look like anything, does it? I'll get rid of you so I can press my blue mushroom switch in peace. Find out what blue mushroom switch does. Well, of course, trying to get a bit more spell experience, because why not? I feel like we must have leveled up his sword quite handily now to get a lot of wit. Now that I'm looking at the grind to get fire up, it's going to be one of the more nightmarish kind of things. Oh wow, wow, I've level two spells. Wow. Um, what do I do then? Probably should hit the recover point. I mean, I've always got level three. <laughs> Gadwin will get there one day. One day, Gadwin, I believe. I believe in you, man. Good job, Sue. Maybe you should cry for six days straight like your wife told you to. <laughs> right, so we have two different switches. The blue one opens some stairs. The red one... ...said no. Okay, that actually got to here. Now there's two blue switches. Oh god. Rotational platforms. It's all too confusing for a poor boy like me. What did the other blue one do? Oh. I have no clue, because it's not repressible. It looks like Typhoon Tower level 1 is built as well to have you constantly falling back down to it. Which is, again, a nightmare. <laughs> How long have we spent in here already? Let's have a look, shall we? Are we past hour 19? 